I first started dunking, junior year, going into my junior year. Javante Green, what stood out to me about you from the second that I saw you playing the first time in, in, in the, during the Summer League was that your athleticism is just off the charts. When in your life did you start to realize that you were just built differently than some of these other guys when it came to athleticism? Um, I feel like when I was in high school, like uh, I first started dunking, um, junior year, going into my junior year. Like, you know, all season I had the little, the one hand dunk, one hand dunk, two hand dunk. Then that summer, like, I think I, like some hit me, like I just started trying stuff. And like, then I started winning medal 360. I've seen you kind of do some flushes, some medium dunks, and then there's some where you just like yam it on them hard. Like, how do you decide during a play like this, what level of power you're gonna slam a dunk with. I felt him trailing me, so I felt like I had to, you know, take some power. I couldn't just go up like weak because, you know, if you go up weak, you can block it, knock the ball loose, or anything. So I just felt like right here, I had to try to go up as hard as I could. So for you as an athlete coming down the court at full speed, what's the process of finishing an alley oop when you don't necessarily know where the ball's going? or when it's coming to you? If you if you look at the clip, I gotta get my feet set when I see him about to pass it. So I feel like that's when you, like that's when the timing and everything come up. And like, once the ball is in the air, you like, being that I'm a, um, so athletic, I can read the ball and know where, know where it is and how to, how to catch it and try to finish it. All right, let's jump into this last dunk. And this one is again against Charlotte. For some reason, you like dunking against this team. But the reason I want to look at this one is because to me, when I watched this live in the game, you slammed it and I was like, that shouldn't have even been a dunk. That should have been a layup because you look where you catch it and then where the defender is in your body position, it just kind of blew me away that you were able to finish this with a dunk because normally it would be a layup for most people. So how do you turn this into a dunk uh, when, when you've got a defender in your, in your way and when you catch it from beyond the free throw line? I mean, I just, I, I feel like I see it already, you know, um, just trying to see like where, like the defender is. And I see he's he's coming, like right now when I catch it, he's like running past me. Mm -hmm. So I just, all you had to do is stop, let's go up. Javante, thanks for coming Thank in. Thank you. And remember, he's not just a dunker, he does a whole lot else out there. <laughs> so appreciate this man for what he brings to the Celtics. Appreciate it.